situation continues to be grim in the northeast as the death toll due to the floods have risen to 23. Assam continues to be one of the worst hit states as six people have died in the state in the last 24 hours. In Assam, four and a half lakh people have been affected in the deluge across six districts. The number of livestock killed has been estimated at 400, while the area of paddy fields affected is at 3,947 hectares so far. The overall flood situation in Tripura improved significantly with water receding in all the major rivers of the state. 32,000 people affected in Tripura and are still housed in relief camps. So Arindam Das joining me from Assam on the latest situation there. Arindam, uh, this is an annual uh, phenomena in the state of Assam. Give us a, a sense of the extent of damage. Is enough being done to make sure that uh, the damages are minimized at this point? Yes, with the onset of monsoon, uh, Assam as well as the three other states, Manipur, Tripura and Mizoram, has uh, faced flash floods and landslides. This is the first wave of flood. Uh, uh, Assam is the worst affected uh, so far. Uh, 4.5 lakh people in six districts of the state are affected by this wave of flood. Uh, the worst affected districts are Karimganj and Haila Gandhi, where alone uh, around uh, uh, 3 lakh population are affected. Uh, in fact, uh, uh, rail and surface communication was, was also snapped uh, because of landslides, which has been restored as of now. But uh, the good thing is that uh, there has been marginal improvement in the flood situation in Tripura and Manipur. Uh, in in Mizoram, several houses got damaged due to landslides. Uh, as of now, the total death toll in Assam has gone up to 11, and uh, in the entire northeast it has gone up to 23. Okay. So, uh, NDRF, SDRF, and Army are pressing to rescue and relief operations. Uh, but right now, uh, since uh, there is an improvement in the flood situation, the rescue operations have stopped. Uh, so, the focus is on providing relief and send that to the flood affected people. Right. The focus is on providing immediate relief and emergency services to the flood affected. In terms of crops, uh, in terms of livestock as well, there are ma major damages are in them. We can see those pictures, how the entire low-lying areas in several parts have been completely inundated. Yes, uh, vast tracts of uh, cultivable lands uh, are also affected by uh, this sort of flood uh, the low-lying areas are the worst affected. Uh, as I mentioned, that Karimganj and Hailakandi are the worst affected districts uh, by this river flood, where uh, alone around 3 lakh population are affected, and large uh, uh, tracts of cultivable land are also underwater. Hmm. Uh, so this has damaged uh, the crops. Uh, in fact, uh, right now, uh, the, the administration is also trying to provide uh, a, a compensation for the, the loss of crops uh, to the people, right. uh, apart from giving relief uh, to the flood affected people. Right. So 11 dead in Assam so far, 23 in the entire northeast. Really, the situation looks grim as we speak. Thanks for joining us, Arindam, with the latest.